I mean, the worst time to break up with a guy is before he goes in for surgery, unless he's a doctor. But, I mean, if he's a doctor, why would you be breaking up with him? <laughs> Although I did actually have one of my best breakups in a hospital. There was this guy that I really, really wanted to break up with because he was being super rude. He was being really mean to me. But I had a hard time doing it because he'd just been in this really awful car accident. But then he slipped into this coma and when he woke up out of the coma, he couldn't even remember that we'd been dating. So I didn't have to break up with him. How many people have you dated that ended up in a hospital? Excuse you, David. So, if you have to break up with a guy, don't do it on an airplane. Because I'm not saying that I'm afraid of flying in general, but I just, I don't love the idea of being on a jet with, um, you know, an emotionally unstable prince when I don't know where all the weapons are hidden. I guess, and then, my last piece of advice would be that restaurants are great for breakups. I love restaurants for breakups. But the thing with that is that if you do do it at a restaurant, I would wait until dessert is served because you're just not gonna have a pleasant meal. Anyway, so get the dessert and then just kind of spit it out. Spit, spit the, spit the, like, the fact that you don't like him out, not the dessert, finish the dessert.